Good morning, guys. I thought I would just do a Mother Earth heart card this morning. Um, it helps to ground me, and I'm feeling like I really could use some grounding this morning. So I thought if I can use some grounding or a focal point, uh, maybe somebody else there also can. And again, these cards just help to bring a focus, um, something to tune into, to become more connected with our own heart energy, because we're all one through divine love and light, we are one with the heart of Mother Earth. So these are guidance from Mother Earth to help us to tune into our heart energy. And when we do that, that is the energy of God's self. That is our higher self speaking to us. That is the truest, highest frequency of our own energy. And you know what you focus on grows. So as you tune into the heart energy and become more aligned to those frequencies, your life will reflect back those frequencies, that vibration, that reflection that is true or more representative of who you really are. So, um, oops, the card immediately came out. Oh, great. <laughs> this one. <clears throat> this one is acceptance of self. And this one is a very good one for me this morning. I'm feeling very ungrounded in myself. Um, questioning, not trusting. So this is definitely appropriate for me. Um, you can always ask, always ask your inner self to uh, <clears throat> interpret and to receive the messages in the way that your own heart wants to bring it forth. So I'll read the uh, message and then I will interpret the front. And this card, let me just shut my ringer off in case anyone tries to write, uh, call me while I'm doing this. All right, so it's uh, entitled Acceptance of Self, and the message is when we label and judge others for how they are living and simply being, we are masking judgment against ourselves. They are manifestations of the limitations we place to live freely from the heart. Judgments are reflections of self-denial. They need to be integrated into the light in order to live in true freedom. So this card is just talking about judgment. Um, Judgment is a lower vibration because, you know, the purity of God is love, acceptance, compassion. And when we are feeling judged or judging, it's always to do with acceptance of self. All of, all of the outside world is just a gift and it's a mirror to help us to tune in and to become more self-realized, to learn about self. So if there's somebody in the outside world that you might be criticizing, judging, or a situation, or whatever it may be, always bring it within and say, how may this be a reflection? How may this be a mirror of my own um, judgment against myself, my own criticism, my own um, knives that I might be pointing at myself? Or also if you are feeling judged from somebody else or feeling the the being the receiving end of criticism that too is most like is usually a reflection of something you are feeling towards yourself and you might not be you might be in denial or not accepting it so in order to get your attention the universe which is still you your higher self orchestrating events to help you expand and come into who you really are You've brought that into your life in order to make you face something. Because a lot of times we do shove things behind our brain, behind our mind, things we don't want to deal with. So the outside world is a gift in that it mirrors something within ourselves that we may need to grow and expand upon within ourselves to integrate those energies. And it's not even saying that those judgments or criticisms are truth or untruth. It's just about accepting and realizing and just bringing it to the light so that it may be transcended into a higher vibration of love and light. That's what this card is telling us. Um, so a lot of times, all the time, <laughs> the world is always giving you what you need in order to tune into the heart. And sometimes it has to come across stronger to get our attention. And sometimes we are the light for others and they might not like that light. So they might wanna, you know, it might be bright for them. They don't want to acknowledge something within themselves. So they might come back in defense mode or do something to judge you also. <laughs> 
because that bright and they're just you're you're reflecting something bright to them that they don't want to um, integrate or uh, accept or acknowledge within themselves so sometimes you might feel that effect but you are their reflection to help them ding turn on the light in order to see something in themselves they just need to love something they just need to accept something they need to not judge so that's what this card is telling us and the image too uh, um, portrays this perfectly it's a dried up piece of dirt that has fallen off the tread of a car uh, the tire you can see the tread marks and it does it looks worn it looks dried up it's against the hard pavement so that in itself isn't even comfortable either so a lot of times also what, what this is saying when it's laying against the pavement is it doesn't feel comfortable either to judge others or to judge yourself or to be the receiving end of that or even to be the giver of that. It doesn't feel good because it's not the highest truth of a situation. It's there to bring us into a greater expansion and enlighten us and to tune us within, but it's not comfortable because we are not seeing the higher perspective and the higher truth of that situation. And that's what it feels like. It feels like we've been run over doesn't feel good and we're holding as the longer we wait to accept ourselves or integrate things within ourselves that we need to that it feels like that it feels like scars running across our heart all that's all those marks and the way to resolve it is through self-love accepting oneself doing something for yourself that feels good that brings you in those higher vibrations because when you're in that higher vibration and in alignment to the heart and how you know that is it does feel good it does feel light it feels peaceful it feels accepting it feels com comfortable in a way that it's peaceful i'm not saying that we don't go through discomfort in order to grow but i'm saying when we're seeing the highest truth of something it does feel right it doesn't feel like you're all dried up laying on a hard piece of pavement and that is the voice of God within you when it directs you. It's the feeling. It, it speaks through feelings and emotions. There really aren't words. Words. It's a feeling. And when you can get to yourself in those feelings of self-love, of accepting, doing things that are good for you, you automatically will um, accentuate your light, amplify it to help you to um, integrate things or bring to awareness also things that you might need to um, release or um, find the higher truth of through the higher frequencies because when you're in higher frequencies you are in a more open state of receiving to become to see the truth of situations in your life but you also as you're in that higher vibration and frequency you are going to reflect that back in your life also your self-love helps to heal yourself put you in a good spot and then the people situations in your life that are being mirrored back to you they will be representative of that higher frequency and love also so this is just saying in a nutshell <laughs> um just uh, anytime you're feeling discomfort or feeling criticized or critical to others, it's always to just do with something within yourself that you are not seeing from a higher level or that you are judging or feeling bad about. Like guilt is a good one. Guilt serves not you, doesn't serve anyone, and you might be judging yourself and feeling guilty that you're not fulfilling expectations that you think you're supposed to. It could be as simple as that. And if you are feeling that, let it go, let it go. It's okay. It's okay to feel all those. We're human. Sometimes as human beings, we're spirits expressing through a human vehicle. And sometimes that can be tough because we got to take on those lower frequencies and densities. But we're not here to take them on and hold them. We're here to transcend them. So say, hey, it's okay. It's okay that I feel this way and let it go. Say, we all go through this. It's all part of evolving. Just knowing that whatever you go through and you don't need to know the why, that you are evolving and expanding and transcending stuff and you don't know that you don't have to know the hows or the whys just know that it is so just um be gentle on yourself and be gentle on others because we are all one and everyone is a reflection of an aspect of who we are that brings ourself into our own awareness so hopefully this helps somebody out there in some way shape or form it could have been just one word you hear you heard that you needed to hear for the day and if it made your heart jump or you felt excited or relief that's all you needed to get out of it 
So thanks a lot, guys. Thanks for listening. Have an awesome day.